Welcome guys. In today's tutorial, I'm going to be taking you through how to install C on Visual Studio Code in order to be able to write and compile the code right in Visual Studio Code Editor. So let's dive right in. The first thing is to go to this web address and download Visual Studio Code depending on your operating system. When you install Visual Studio Code, open it okay so after you install you will get something like this then at the extensions tab over here where my mouse is hovering on you click all right and when it opens you type c now the next thing is to click on this first one the one which has microsoft as the author so you click on it and then you install it i have already installed it that is why you see it in this format if it is not installed you will see only one button install all right so you download visual studio code and install the c stroke c plus plus extension from the extensions tab now after installing this extension we go to this web address and download this compiler for windows good so you click on download and then it is done okay okay so guys this is my setup all right so the next thing is to double click the setup to run then we click install we leave everything as is then we click on continue it is going to download and set up the installation manager okay so my download is complete now we, the next thing is we click continue all right it is going to process and then at this stage the right thing for us to do now is to look for two packages and install them the first one is the main W32 base. This one, we click on it and mark it for installation. Then we look for the 32 GCC G++. That is this one and mark it for installation. All right. Now, after doing that, we have to come here and then click on apply changes okay after marking these two this one here and then this one so you see that they are marked we come to the installation tab and click apply changes then we still go ahead and click apply changes it is going to connect and download these two packages which are necessary for us to continue with the installation all right guys so as you can see all changes were applied successfully you may now close this dialog so everything was successfully done and so i click on close all right guys so now that our installation is done the first thing is to go to our drive c where we run our installation and then in this main w folder we open it and then click on the bin then you click over here to copy the directory path so we copy it just like that and the next thing to do is right click on this pc click on properties and then when you add properties you click on advanced system settings in advanced system settings the next thing is to click on environment variables okay the next thing is to click on environment variables then we go to system variables so system variables we look for part then we click on edit so we are going to add a new path so you click on new and then we right click to paste what we copied from 
the Ming W file and click OK. Then we click OK once again and we can click OK to exit here as well. So this is how we install and use C code in VS code. Okay guys, so now that our installation is successful, we will have to open command prompt with administrator privileges. So open command prompt as an administrator. And then to verify if the installation was successful, you can just type GCC then version. And guys, you see that we have the version of GCC installed on the machine 6.30. So our installation was successful. Okay, so now that we've confirmed that we have successfully installed the GCC compiler and C in VS Code, let's test our setup and see if it's working. All right. So I've um, created a folder in my music directory called C Code. So I just right click and then open it with code i'm going to compile uh, some code to see if it will work so let's name this file test.c and let's start with our include statement we want to be able to use um, the standard input output header good we have it now let's write some line of code so let's say int main you can use void if you want problem with that then um, i can just write some code here and then call on the printf function and open my braces welcome to c on vs code then i close it and try to run this to see whether it is going to work or not so i come over here guys you can see there's an icon here then i click run c plus c or c plus plus file okay so when i click this it is going to ask me which one to use then i going to ask for this one all right so it has started running in my terminal let me open it for you to see build computer successfully right so guys this is it welcome to c on vs code so you see that the program exited with code zero that means that it was successful so we've been able to run the c program in vs code just in a few steps all right Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, to like, and to comment on the video. Till next time, ciao.